Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to do preparations for a sashimi, tuna sashimi and this is a uh, vlog number 58 and I'm Dr. Zero Malio. so I used a I used Frabel uh, sashimi tuna sashimi which is my favorite because it's the only one that I could buy straight off from any supermarket uh, of course there are other options for sashimi uh, here in Subic we have uh, another one. Maybe I'll make a new video about it, about this uh, this uh, store that sells salmon sashimi, which is which uh, provides us with some premium cut. So uh, the first thing you need to do is take it out, uh, defrost it or thaw it, or uh, whatever you have to do, just so that it's not frozen and it's easier to cut. When you're using a knife. I, when you're choosing for a knife to cut the uh, sashimi, you can choose um, any sharp knife. So in here, in this video, I'm using a chef's knife to cut through the uh, sashimi. But of course, you can use a sashimi knife if you want. But the important thing here is that you cut straight through the uh, through the uh, sashimi uh, without the uh, without doing any zigzag pattern or like sewing it in half you know because you want the, the clean cut of the sashimi in there so anyway I, I used the uh, technique from uh, for our chef where you use the edge of the uh, fingers to find out where you're going to cut okay just to estimate how you're going to cut it and then afterwards I used a kitchen towel to take out uh, any other moisture from it and then of course I don't do preparations for the uh, sashimi sauce uh, soy sauce other people just use soy sauce and add calamansi or lemon but uh, I buy straight from uh, from the supermarket the Kikuman uh, sushi and sashimi sauce and then uh, for the wasabi I like to use the powder because that's uh that we, we can do a lot of uh, artistic stuff with the powder so here i am i'm going to do um some artwork with the sashimi uh i used to take pictures of this on instagram and i call it the uh, sashimi flower actually i think it's the sashimi flower so anyway you just put like a teaspoon of sashimi of uh, wasabi on the on any small bowl and just put water enough just so you can moisturize every particle of it and then once you once you have it uh, sort of tasty like you can roll it in your arm on your on your hands and your palms wherein you can create like a clay mixture a green clay mixture of the of the wasabi and then you just you just press it into a circular form and then you with the edge of the uh, chef's knife or any knife that you've used to cut the um, sashimi you can create your pattern just like how I'm doing it here in this video and then you serve the service that uh, you can serve the uh, sashimi cold if you like or you can just wait another a few more minutes just so uh, other mo the moisture can go off but that's it uh, you just need two ch uh, chopsticks and then you're off and, and uh, if you if you like this video uh, show some support and uh, give me a thumbs up sign and um, subscribe and also um, if you if you want other people to learn from this you can uh, share this in your social media accounts and also those on Facebook thank you very much for watching my other videos